Hey guys, it's Alexis and welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing a super fun video all about date nights. I picked an outfit for every single occasion. I hope you guys enjoy and let's get started. So starting out casual with outfit number one, I paired these split hem leggings from Misguided with a basic white crop tank top. This one is from White Fox Boutique and my platform white Converse uh, high tops. I paired it with two different jacket options. The first one is just this plain uh, like butter yellow button down. I got this from a consignment store a little while ago. I really like this. It gives it a, the outfit a little bit of a pop of color. It makes it a little bit more interesting than just plain leggings and a tank top. Um, I really like this if I was doing anything super casual like going to a movie theater, uh, going to a park, anything where you're kind of being, I don't know, a little bit more lazy, just because the leggings are extremely comfortable, I wouldn't want to wear like jeans to a movie date. Um, I put the button down on just in case it gets cold in the movie theater. That way you can, you know, have an extra layer on. But yeah, super cute, very casual. Okay, for the second option, I picked this black coat that I got. I believe it's a knockoff of the Arrivals jacket, which is probably, I think, $1,000. This one is probably $40 from Forever 21 that I got in high school over five years ago that I still own. I really like this coat though. It has a fur lining, so it's extremely warm and perfect if you are going to the movie theaters because you can pretty much use it as a blanket. And I paired it with this PVC little satchel from a Doc Martin store that I got in New York. I love this bag. So outfit two is a little bit more dressy. I paired these straight cut light wash BDG jeans from Urban Outfitters with a floral top that I got from a boutique in my hometown in South Florida, as well as these Espergil wedges and a little wicker bag, I guess you could say, or like woven bag from Urban Outfitters. My hair clip is also from Amazon. I love this outfit. I think this would be perfect if you're just doing like a casual daytime date, whether or not that's like getting coffee, meeting up for any drinks, going to the park, just anything that is a little bit more dressy, Perfect for first date as well. I love this, it's very romantic. Outfit number three, again, is a little bit more dressy. This I would wear if I was going to something that required like a dress code or if I was doing a brunch. I would also wear this to like a girl's day as well. I mean, pretty much, you. You can go on dates with your girlfriends. I think that's like a normal thing. So I would wear this. Like I said, if I was getting brunch, getting drinks, anything during the daytime. Also, I know Labor Day is next week and that whole like can't wear white on white is like not a thing. But honestly, who cares, right? And I love the pop of red in my bag. This I got from a consignment store. It is eel and I absolutely ruined it because I got it wet, but I don't care. I still wear it and I still love it. The top is from J. Crew. The bottoms are from Express. The shoes are from a thrift store. Again, the bag is consigned and I'm wearing a little pearl bracelet. It's a freshwater pearl bracelet from the store Francesca's, I believe. I love this outfit though. It's very chic, almost like Rosie Huntington Whiteley meets your grandma who likes to dress up. Love it. So we are going extremely romantic with outfit number four. I'm wearing this red velvet dress from Reformation and I paired it with little white sneakers from Adidas. I think this outfit is so sweet. So just so precious. I don't know what I'm saying, but I love this. I would wear this if I was going to a park for a picnic, just walking around, maybe going like downtown with your significant other, just super cute, a little bit more elevated rather than jeans and a t-shirt. For outfit number five, we are doing the daytime version of the little black dress. This dress is from Zara. I love this dress. I love the neckline. I love the sleeves. I love the way it fits on my body. Everything about it, obsessed with it. I paired this dress with these light blue little strappy sandals from Mark Fisher. And I call these grandma bags. They're just little beaded purses that I find at consignment stores. This one has a pink and blue design on it and the blue beads match my shoes perfectly. That's why I paired it together. And also a pro tip, if you do wear little bags like these that pretty much don't fit anything, I change out my wallet for these little like cigarette holders that I get also at consignment stores. You can just throw your cards in there. That way you don't have anything super bulky in your bag and it just is like a perfect size. For outfit number six, we are doing the after work 
date look. This dress is just a hot pink wrap dress with a wood pattern on it. This is from the brand DVF or Diane von Furstenberg. I can never, I can never pronounce her name right. I hope I did this time, but I paired it with these brown suede heels from Sam Edelman and the same pearl bracelet from Francesca's. I love this outfit. I think I would wear this during the day if I wasn't at work and I could wear it to the office as well because it is work appropriate. I just think it's a little bit more fancy than your average just like pencil skirt and shirt. That way you can literally run from the office right to your date. You can probably just throw like a little handbag in your work bag and then you're good to go. We are getting even more dressed up for outfit number seven. Uh, for this look, I am wearing all black. I'm wearing this extra long trench coat. This is just a merino wool coat that I got from a consignment store that I'm obsessed with. Uh, for the actual outfit though, if I will take this off, uh, there we go. Uh, for the outfit, I'm wearing this black corset top from Misguided matched with these black paper bag trousers from Express. I'm wearing Louboutin heels that have these really pretty studs on them. I like the heel with this outfit just because the red gives it a little pop of color. The necklace that I'm wearing is just a freshwater pearl necklace. I don't love it. I think it's a little bit, I don't know, it's a little bit costumey. And the clutch I'm wearing is just a leather clutch from Nordstrom. Again, I think this is perfect for any like dinner date or slightly more fancy cocktail date. Perfect for nighttime. For outfit number eight, I did the nighttime version of the little black dress. This is also an alternative to the pant outfit I just did if you wanted to go a little bit more sexy. For the coat, I'm just wearing this black leather jacket that I consigned. The same shoes that I wore in the last outfit again from Louboutin and the same black leather clutch from Nordstrom. But the little black dress that I'm wearing is from Depop and the corset I'm wearing over top is from Misguided. I did pop the corset on just to give my dress a little bit more shape, just to really accentuate my waist and it just makes it a little bit different. For this look, I just turned the corset around so you could see the black zipper. I think this is really cute if you're going somewhere a little bit more casual and you just wanna be super sexy. Uh, I really like it. Full transparency, I can get away with this because I am in the bitty bitty titty committee. So the actual like cup for your boobs doesn't really show up on this corset. But I really like this. I think this is perfect for a night out. We are going flirty and fun for outfit number nine. The outfit I'm wearing is a little houndstooth two-piece set from Free People. I'm wearing that same jacket from the last outfit, again, that is consigned. Uh, the boots I have on are these little like faux crocodile boots from Aldo. I love this set. I can wear this together. I can wear the two pieces separate with a bunch of different variations. I've Got this, I think, a couple of years ago, and I still wear it to this day. I'm obsessed with this look. I think this is perfect if you're doing something slightly more casual, maybe going out at night. Um, love this look, though. And for the last look of the video, we went super flirty and sexy. I am wearing this little purple, kind of like... It's like a lavender, I guess you could say. A little lavender negligee with white lace. I'm wearing the same leather jacket I've worn before. Again, this is consigned from an online store. Uh, the boots I'm wearing are just like little Doc Martin combat boots. I think this would be really cute for like a concert or any bar that you're going to at night. It's just like slightly more dressed up than jeans and a t-shirt. I did change out my shoes and my jacket in this look. Um, instead of the leather jacket, I'm wearing this pinstriped blazer. And instead of the combat boots, I am wearing these like black suede little knee-high boots. I think this outfit is so cute. You could wear this with your boyfriend or girlfriend, or you can wear this going out with your friends for a little friends date. I love this outfit. Again, I think you could honestly wear this wherever. Yeah, very flirty, very fun. And that is it. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Go ahead and click subscribe if you have not already. Leave a comment down below for what you want me to do next. I would love to hear your guys' ideas. But yeah, thank you so much for watching and I will see you next week. Bye.